Yo, what is good guys? Hope you guys are having a good ass day. So, uh, letting the BMW warm up. I haven't turned it on all day. I'm with my boy David. Uh, that's my boy, making sure that shit doesn't get stolen, you know. He has coilovers now, so my boy actually cares about his Civic now. Just a little bit more. But uh, right now we're gonna go pick up Leo, and uh, we're gonna head to the store. And I'm gonna buy a fan because it doesn't look like it, guys, but right now it's like 100 degrees. It's fucking st stupid humid. We good. You good? Yeah, you sure? We good. We good. Yeah, so it's stupid humid, guys. So we are gonna be working on the Civic today. So I'm gonna get a fan. And uh, because I'm not trying to pass out. And yeah, so we're gonna pick up Leo. I'm gonna pick up a fan. I'm also gonna pick up some paint. And uh, you guys will find out why we need some paint. Does it, does it feel good in here? Yeah, I got the AC blasting. Okay. We are back. Um, it's just me right now because Leo and David went to go smog uh, Leo's Tundra. But they'll be back shortly. But I'm going to go ahead and get started. So I picked up some uh, paint stripper. And I also picked up some paint. I don't know where it is. But yeah, guys, my uh, valve cover has been like leaking a shitload. Not from the front, but from the back. I don't know if you can really see, but you can see all the oil that's accumulated on my intake manifold. And it's just been getting all over the place, so um, I'm going to change out the gasket. And uh, I'm also going to paint it. That's why I got the paint stripper. And I'm also going to paint my intake. I, I've been lagging on this intake. I can't find the second piece for it. If you guys find the piece that like shoots out, because it's a two piece, so it goes down and then it shoots it like in front of the wheel so you can get more air. I can't find a second piece, so I might just have to buy a whole thing, so I'm still running this shitty intake, so I, I think I'm going to just paint it, you know, just to make it look semi, you know, decent. And I'm also going to paint this because I'm tired of the wrinkle look because it didn't come out, you know, clean. It takes, like, a lot of uh, time if you want it to look clean. Like, as you get it to, like, bare metal. But, um, yeah, I'm going to paint it a different color. And, um, yeah, I just don't like how it looks when it gets all dirty, so... Yeah, I'm going to take care of that today, guys. So I'm going to go ahead and take it off, and uh, I'm going to remove all the paint, hopefully, with the paint stripper. Alright, guys, valve cover is off, so now I'm, pro I'm just going to clean it, because it's all, like, super dirty and stuff. And then I'm going to hit it with the paint stripper, and hopefully the paint stripper takes most of it away. And if anything, I'll just sand it at the end. But, uh, yeah, valve cover is off. And I'm also leaking somewhere in the bottom, so uh, after I assemble everything back together, I'm going to jack up the car and see what's leaking under there. Hopefully it's just some loose oil pan uh, bolts or maybe the oil filter, I don't know if I tightened it enough. But I'm going to go ahead and look under there and see what's going on because it's getting out of hand. And hopefully the fan is not too loud. It's, it's 100 degrees out here, guys. I had to get a fan. But, uh, yeah. And that didn't take, I'm probably gonna paint it just black, just keep it simple. I'm tired of that dinky ass red. Should probably take off the oil cap. That'd be a good idea. So, in case you guys are wondering what uh, paint strip I'm using. I picked this up at Home Depot, this shit will focus. Yeah, so I picked this up at Home Depot. I think it was like six or seven dollars. I've used it before and I really like it. Clean strip. And it's gonna put in some work. I'm gonna let it simmer down for like, maybe like 10 minutes or so. And then uh, I'm gonna rinse it off and then hit it again. All right guys, so it's been about 10 minutes and you can already see that the metal is showing and I haven't even rinsed it off or anything so Feeling really good about that. Also took off this bunk ass intake and I sanded it down a little bit and I cleaned it. I'm gonna paint it just a, just a gloss black because that's the only type of black that I have. So fuck it, I'm gonna paint this. And uh, yeah, it should look a lot better than this uh, Spider-Man fucking combo I got going here. And that's that. All right guys. So uh, yeah, valve cover looks really good. Everything, all the paint is off, all the wrinkle paint. It was kind of a bitch to get off, but uh, yeah, that shit really came in clutch. 
made it super easy so I'm gonna go ahead and let that bake in the sun and when it's completely dry I'm gonna hit it with primer and then I'm gonna paint it and if we go back over here my boy Leo's back and I'm also painting my intake just painting it black alright guys primer is setting in right now and I'm gonna be painting it yellow I think it's gonna look sick I'm going to take my time and do multiple coats of this. I'm going to probably use the whole bottle. Just, you know, looks nice and I really want a good finish. And I hope I have some clear coat uh, laying around because I don't think this is high temperature resistant. So, yeah, we got to make this shit look as nice as possible. This is some fucking home paint. Yeah, we got enamel, bro. Hell no, this shit ain't... This shit's going to last up to like 100 degrees. I don't know, but yeah, I'm gonna try to do this as best we can. I couldn't find like the high temperature engine paint. They only had like copper and orange and black and shit like that. So yeah, hopefully. I just gonna look like the spoon wrap. Oh, 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 why you gotta do me like that, Leo? All right, guys. So I'm not done yet. I'm probably gonna do like two more coats, but that's how it's looking so far. I'm really happy with it. That's not as bright or vibrant as I would have wanted, but you know, it'll do. I fuck with it. Looks like SpongeBob. Oh, bro. What you guys? What you guys got doing? Wait, 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 bro. What are you trying to do, bro? Wait, wait, wait. Trying to make it into the sunroof. My boy Kobe Bryant. Hopefully. All right. Go for it. Go for it. Is that the most your sunroof can slide back? Yeah. All right. That's kind of slim. Oh, oh, almost. Oh, oh. <laughs> one more time, one more time. You got that. Oh, oh fuck. Nah, 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 one more Ow. Time. Oh, let me see. Ow. One more time, dude. One more time. Oh, it was going yeah, in. Yeah, that was going in. Oh. Hey, let's go. <laughs> hey, you won, bro. You won. Hell oh, yeah, Alright guys, so uh, we kind of have to go, but my shit's still like super sticky, so I'm gonna just hold off until tomorrow and show you guys the final product. But right now we're gonna head over to Leo's house, and uh, he's gonna do some fuckery with uh, Marcus's exhaust. And yeah guys, I really don't want to rush it, I want to clear coat it and actually let oh. Yeah guys, I really don't want to rush it, so I'm gonna just finish it tomorrow. I did throw the intake on, it's a little, it's whatever, but it's a lot better than it being red. So you want to go to Leo's house, and yeah, I'll show you guys when this is finished tomorrow. Just drive it like that. Oh, yeah, fuck it? Yeah. Fuck it, dude. No spark plugs, no nothing, dude. Fuck it. Should turn on. You put the spark plugs on. Because <laughs> it's dry. You probably could start Just like keep that. going. No destination. Just keep going straight. Alright, guys. We here at Leo's. What's up, Marcus? I gotta leave already. What? You're leaving already? Yeah. Oh, hey, man. I thought you were going to do this shit. Yeah. I'll be back tomorrow. Alright. Wait, wait, wait. If Wait, what the f If that's his If that's his sus Oh, okay. I saw okay. I get it. <laughs> I get it now. Wait, wait, wait. Hey, yo, y'all both got the first guy, bro. Okay, that's the difference. Okay. I see. Okay. Wait, who was telling his sister to get an SI bumper? They're the same shit. That's fog lights. That's fog lights, though. Oh, that's through horsepower from fog lights. So that's what makes an SI bumper fog lights. I don't think that's yeah. the difference. I think you can probably get that as an option with this car. No, so I remember someone's telling you, hey, get, a, get a SI bumper. I know uh -huh. they make like this, like.
Yeah, I just want to get everything together. They said, they said that I should, uh, some guy commented that I should have recorded that whole thing, but I didn't. Because I... Burnt corn. <laughs> what? <laughs> you said burnt corn? I don't know, I hate this car now. Hey, Jesse. Shit. How the fuck you fucking... What are you scraping on? Life? Oh. <laughs> hey, Marcel. Marcel. We, we took this, this guy's, uh, Andy's up. What are you doing? You didn't see shit. I can't see you. Oh, yeah? Well, I can't see your mama in the cheeks, one night. <clears throat> what the fuck, man? You started it. All right, guys. It is the next day. Got my boy Leo. It is fucking hot. And, um, uh, yeah, guys. So, I clear-coated the cover last night. And I also hit it again. Just a little bit. Before I threw it on, but it looks really good, guys. And uh, yeah, I already tightened everything down to uh, factory specs with my handy dandy uh, Harbor Brake uh, ratchet. Yeah, but before I play, before I put the spark plugs, I'm gonna sand down this Honda motor. I think it's gonna look really clean, like chrome. And uh, also, I just sand this down a little bit so it can actually get some ground, but. Yeah, guys, I'm really happy with it. It came out dope. Except some gnats got fucking, like, stuck. It's very minor, but, like, some gnats got stuck when it was drying, and that was irritating. So, um, yeah, I'll be right back. I'm gonna just lightly sand this. Hopefully I don't get the paint around it. And, uh, it should look good. Alright, guys. So, look, look how much better it looks with it sanded. Looks so good. And, uh, the wires are back on, so you, now you guys can actually see... <laughs> how it looks and I think it looks fucking dope the only thing irritating me about this bay is the intake like I for real have to do something about it I thought black would help but fuck no ah rest in peace rest in peace to the AEM V2 intake did well at the track anyways guys let's let's ignore that intake but yeah let me let me get the thumbnail real quick oh yeah oh that was golden and guys, this gasket, uh, it fits way better than the last gasket. Like, I just put it on there and I didn't have to, like, fucking guide it or anything. Like, it just, I just put it on there, I put the valve cover on, and it just, it fit flush all the way around. So, hopefully, this one doesn't leak. I'm pretty confident, though. It's, like, flush all the way around. So, I'm going to go ahead and turn her on and see if it leaks. And then, probably end off the video right there. But, hell yeah. People don't think I go for the Chargers now, or some shit. <laughs> I went from Spider-Man to fucking yellow and blue. Fuck it. Wait, wait, I still have a little bit of Spider-Man. Alright guys, so I'm gonna go ahead and end off the video right there. Leo just took off. It's fu this whole week guys it's like 110 so yeah no one's really in the mood to do shit and I don't blame them like right now in this garage it's like fucking so humid and it's it's gross guys it's fucking it sucks but yeah guys hope you guys enjoyed the video I'm super happy with this and uh yeah no more leaking and it looks super clean hopefully that paint lasts because I'm in love with it anyways guys I hope you guys enjoyed the video like if you did subscribe if you're new and yeah guys we'll be back with more videos we got one install coming and a few other videos so stay tuned i'm gonna go ahead and go inside i'm gonna edit this video so hopefully it goes up wednesday and yeah hope you guys enjoy your day and we'll see you in the next one